Korea has a rich tradition of producing top-class players in the doubles format. In men's doubles, the East Asian country has three pairs in the top ten, with golden boys Lee Yong Dae and Yu Yeon Sung ranked number one in the world. With two pairs in the top ten, the women's doubles are making waves as well. Ranked sixth in the world, Jung Hyun Un and Shin Sung Chan are Korea's top women's duo. For a pair that was ranked in the 200s when they first started out in mid-2015, their rise is remarkable, but it wasn't without some bumps in the beginning. In the beginning, we didn't play well and we lacked communication on court. But as time went by, we got better. We talked it out and discussed our problems. We also analyzed our game and we saw we lacked teamwork. Once we identified our issues, our partnership started to improve a lot. I think that's why we're doing well now. Badminton Unlimited met up with Jung and Shin in Seoul, and we spent the afternoon with the duo to find out more about their budding partnership. <laughs> With several senior players calling time on their career, Korea were looking to reinforce their women's doubles team. So active senior players were paired with younger ones. When our seniors retired, the standard of women's doubles declined a bit. We then tried to pair the seniors with the juniors. For example, seniors like myself with Lee So-hee or Shin Sung-chan. We did the same with other players as well, partnering the seniors with juniors. I felt comfortable playing with both of them. And with Shin Sung Chan, we managed to show that we were able to complement each other. It shows on court. I think because the younger players are more powerful and combined with the experience of the seniors, we are able to produce very good women's doubles pairs. Born in Masan, Korea, Jung enjoyed a successful partnership with Kim Hana before they were split at the end of 2014. They were ranked seventh in the world then. With Kim now focusing on mixed doubles with Ko Sung Hyun, Jung moved on, partnering the younger Shin Sung Chan. Shin herself was enjoying success in the junior level with Lee So Hee. The duo were the 2011 and 2012 World Junior Champions, but they needed to raise their game in the senior circuit. So they parted ways to form partnerships with senior players to learn from them. I've spent a lot of time with Lee So Hee. She is my friend. We've known each other for a long time, and we're the same age. So when I partnered Jung Kyung Eun, it was my first time partnering a senior. But she helped me a lot, and she also taught and looked after me. Her many years of experience in the competitive field have been beneficial for me. I don't need to worry about other things, just my own game. I'm very thankful to her. The pair started to reap results after a few months together. At the 2015 Victor Korea Open, the Jung and Shin combo made it to the semi-finals. Buoyed by that, they went on to clinch their first title at the Yonex Denmark Open, a Super Series premier event. Although the duo was awarded a walkover in the final, the unseeded Jung and Shin impressed by beating several seeded pairs along the way. Grabbing two more titles at the Macau Open and the US Grand Prix Championships catapulted the Korean tandem to sixth in the BWF World Rankings by the end of 2015. We had a hard time at first. We couldn't communicate well, and that affected our game. But we worked it out. We discussed our problems and the areas we needed to improve on. And with our desire to win, it eventually helped us in our game. The pair got off to a good start in 2016, winning the Saeed Modi International Badminton Championships, a Grand Prix gold event. Latter stage finishes followed, including a runner-up spot at the Selcom Axiata Malaysia Open, bolstering the Koreans' qualifying place for the Olympics. Ranked sixth in the Race to Rio rankings, Jung and Shin are in a solid position. 
and the pair are gearing up to be at their best in Brazil. We can still see our weaknesses and we don't have much time left before the Rio Olympics. We will talk about our games after the matches or we will watch videos before that. We try to take one step at a time to improve our game. For Jung Kyung Un and Shin Sung Chan, their hunger for success will no doubt drive them to keep reinventing themselves. A force to be reckoned with, this Korean women's tandem looks good to deliver in Rio.